Hello everyone, I am the Flesh 3004. Welcome back to Grounded. Thank you for taking the time to hang out with me. I always enjoy hanging out with you. Welcome back to the channel. We have just done the uh, pond lab. We got that done. So now we can move on to a few other things. I said that at the last of my, at the end of the last episode. And I also wanted to go over one more thing too. In this basket here, we have this toxicology badge and I was thinking that there's a locked door that's underneath that gazebo there my friend and I were my female friend and I were just playing this uh, tonight or last night technically because it is in the morning right now and we went down there and there is we cannot get in that door it takes a different kind of badge so we're not our access card whatever we're not gonna be able to get into there what I did notice with this badge is that if we take it with us, it says gas resist, dust guard, and poison resist. Minus poison resist. Uh, so we have gas resist, but minus poison resist. And I don't know exactly what that means. So I don't want to lose it and have it get destroyed or anything. So I'm not going to take it right now. We have some stuff we need to scan. We have some berry leather, the rotten slime lantern, and a diving bell spider chunk that we need to go get scanned. What I thought I would do too is, let's go see about a couple of other things. If we go to our crafting, we need to make the smithing station. So we need crude rope, sap, brittle marble shard, and brittle quartzite shard so we can upgrade some of our stuff. Let's go see if we can find some of that. I do know we have some in one of these baskets. Okay, let's take that. Let's take that. We are going to need rope. Let's take that. And we are going to need one other thing that I can't remember what it is. Sap. Two sap. Let's go and take that. Now, let's go and see about making this. And let's put that over here by this thing. So that way we have this. All right, let's put that down, and let's just super build. All right, we have that. Now what we can do is get the pieces so that we can upgrade some of our stuff. I want to upgrade the bow, but we need to get some of the whetstone, and we got to do that in our bench, and then we'll go down and scan a few things. Let's go to here. We want to go to the jukebox-looking thing, and let's go to whetstone. And material used to upgrade weapons. Let's go ahead and craft five. How does that sound? Okay. Um, let's do five more. All right. So now we have that. Let's go ahead and see about putting these things back in here. We will make some of this stuff for the armor in a little bit. I just want to make sure that I get some stuff upgraded first. Especially our bow. That's going to be the most important thing. Let's select that, and let's go ahead and upgrade it. 5% damage. We're not going to upgrade it all the way just because, but it would be good to upgrade it some. So let's go ahead and do that. We have four that we can do, so we can do that. Okay. That's going to, if we do one more, it'll take it up to 15% damage and durability, and that's going to help out. What I think we ought to do first is think about that before we decide to do it, because I'd like to see about getting the... Insect bow. That would be awesome if we could. That would be one of the best things. Did go ahead and eat and get water and all that stuff so you don't have to sit Those through. Those aphids look like they have things to do and people to see. Sit through that. And there was a firefly that came by last night, which I've never seen a firefly in this area. So I thought that was really cool. One thing we're going to do too is, as you know, we oftentimes have friends come around the corner up there. If we can build a bench somewhere near here and then build a wall up there, I think that would be for the best. And I'd like to thank Padgy for that too. I think that would be really good. I think it was Padgy. All right, let's go here and let's go analyze these things. Insect hammer, we already know that because we already have that. Okay, let's do this. Awesome. Okay, nothing. That's all right. We're getting close to the next level, and we'll do this. I'm just skipping over that because there's no point in it until it gets close to there. 
Nothing, okay. Getting close, but we still are not going to make it yet. Alright, now what we got to do is go and see, I burgle, go and see if we can do some stuff. I want to get that fence built because that's going to be kind of important considering we got to come down to this lab a lot. Let me go see. We do have, I do have the stuff to be able to make the bench. We just need to take some grass chunks with us and I think we need rope. Let me go back over here so we can grab everything that we need. And let's go see, because if we get that done, that would be really awesome. We could always, you know, tear it apart or even just leave it. That way, if we need to do something over there, we can. All right. Let's go to craft, and let's go see for the... Where did it go to? Workbench. There we go. We need four sprigs, three planks, and we have the sap. Okay, four sprigs. Let's go grab four sprigs. Four sprigs, exactly. That's awesome. And we need three planks. We're going to have to cut down some grass to get some more. So let's just go and take these three planks here. Let's go over there. Let's build that. Once we get that done, then we can build that wall and keep the spitters from coming to wreck us all the time. That would be really good. And I really do get tired of them trying to wreck us. Wreck us, wreck us, wreck us. Wreck is like ruckus. I think it is. It could be. I want to see. I don't think we can build in there, but if we can put a bench up, like maybe down over here, this would be good too. All right. Let's do that. Construct. Turn that guy like that. And let's put him right there. E. Done. Okay. That gun clovers are always in the way. We need them, but sometimes they're in the way. Let's go see about getting some grass planks. We're going to need four per wall, so we do got to keep that in mind. Thought I saw something over there in the corner of my eye, but apparently not. I'm going to get the planks go over there, and then we'll build the wall. All right, got the planks. Let's go over to here, and let's go see about building a wall. Grass wall. Cool. Construct. I know I could carry this stuff up there, but I think it'd be just much easier if we did it like this. Let's turn that guy a little bit like that right there. Okay, there's that. Let's go get some more, and let's continue building that wall. And then I'll show you what we have once we get that far. I have the last piece of the wall that I'm going to put in right now. So let's come up here, and let's go see about... Putting him in right there. That should keep them at bay. Then we don't have to worry about them. We can't get through there, but if we need to get through there, I guess we're really just going to have to, you know, not be too terribly worried about it. We can always find a way to get through there. Of that, I am sure. All right, we got that done. Yay! Now we don't have to worry about being attacked by the spitters when they come out that way, because the orb weavers oftentimes do, as you know. Okay, well, we need to. Well, it's kind of startled me there, Auntie Ant. What we need to do is see how many arrows do we have. We have 20, 40, it's like 38. All told, and two, so we have 60 arrows. We need a lot more than that if we're going to take on the spider, even though that we do have um, a better weapon or, you know, an upgraded weapon is still going to take an awful lot of arrows to do that. What I'm hoping is he'll come out and we can be up on that twig there and we can get him that way. That's what I'm going to hope for. What we're going to have to do, too, is see about making one other thing that's going to be very important. And that thing is going to help us out quite a bit. We need to make a canteen. I don't believe we have a canteen on us anywhere. Okay. Let's get out grub hide and see what we need to make the canteen. Let's go to craft. Let's go to, I think it's underneath here. It is not. Okay. What about underneath here? Yeah, actually, it's under the plus, isn't it? Canteen. Okay, we need that. Let's go ahead and make that. They did change the canteen. That's one of the 
bad things is it is no longer the same thing that it used to be. Let's put that on number seven. Sweet. Now let's go find some water. Or juice or really anything. It has to be course, you know, as you know, the same drops of whatever that you get. So what we ought to do is also think about if we can making like a a dew catcher or something that would be good and then that'll help us out even more let me go find some water good water that is clean water i think i remember where the water is it's underneath one of these logs and it's right around here somewhere i just don't remember where i could be underneath there Well, you know, she spends an awful lot of time just running her little self silly. Um. It's not down there. Let me go see if I can find where those drops are. Because I know they're nearby. I just can't remember where they are. Well, I guess I'll find them when I can. I'm not going to get too terribly worried about it because I, I'm just not going to be able to. I really need water right now. So we're going to be sorry if we don't get any water here real soon. Let's go check in here. Okay. That helps. Thank you so much. Could have used a canteen for, but we really needed a drink. Now maybe we can go find some water. I just remember there was some water underneath there, but I don't know where, and I haven't found it yet. I swore it was right, like right there, but maybe it isn't. Maybe it's right underneath here. Yes, it is. I should have come over here first. Oh well, that's okay. We can have some water. Scoop that, and let's scoop that. And the one thing that I was going to say with the canteen is, let me go find another scoop of water somewhere, and I'll show you. There's only two scoops we can get in the canteen, so I don't need to really show you anything, but I can tell you. Two scoops in the canteen is all that it is, and that's going to be one of the things we're going to have to keep in mind. There used to be four, and for whatever reason, they decided to take that away. We gotta put our bow back on, our upgraded bow back on. Okay. Let's go here, let's go seven. And we cannot get any more. So we're just gonna have to drink that and hope for the best that we can keep ourselves good. I do believe there's gonna be a uh, Oh, okay. Thought maybe there was something bad over there, but I think the bad thing is over here. It could be a ladybug, but I figured that it was probably a stink bug, and it is. Run away! You know, friend, you are really, really, really slow. I know you can only run so fast. Well, you really need to run fast. Sometimes you're just not the fastest runner. Hi, hi, hi. That was a little frightening. We're not ready for that yet. Wow, there's a couple of ladybugs here, huh? Let's go grab some more needles. I'm going to work on that, and we're going to go see if we can make some more arrows, and then we can begin seeing about getting a speed air all taken care of i just gotta find out where the needles are they're right over here sweet what oh guess we can go drop stuff first and then we'll work on that before we go seeing about taking on the spider there's one thing that we really need to do this armor here is not this armor this is not the best armor. putting on some more armor this armor here is decent but as you can see the defense is down quite a ways if we go to here then you know about the this armor here the 
uh, koi scale armor. Now the spider armor, it's decent too. It's about as good as the koi scale, and the koi scale is a lot easier to get. What I'm going to do is actually make these pieces, because we do have a lot of that stuff there. I just hope we have enough rope. Let me go make sure that we do. Okay, there's enough rope for that. Uh, doesn't take any rope and cool we have nope that's not the right one okay we do have enough pieces let's start with this here let's go in and craft that then we'll make the chest piece let's go ahead and craft that and then we're going to make the koi scale helmet this is level two and it's also going to be quite a bit better so let's go ahead and craft that Sweet. So now we have that. Let's put on this and this and this. I said that. There we go. All right. So now we have perfect block. Extends a perfect block timing window and slight stamina increase required to swing weapons. All right. Cool. Dazzling riposte, riposte. Enemies you per perfect block are filled with self doubt okay cool so now we have that let's go see about our status is all we have is mertine wait what's that that one is Grassmaster. like an insatiable lumberjack you're becoming a living lawnmower your intimate knowledge of chopping grass allows you to topple them with increasing ease okay i'm not going to get to worry about that the mertine thing really helped out a lot that was awesome now we got to go get mites because we don't have enough. I only have 80 hours right now. And as you know, the, the wolfies are fairly tough. What I'm going to do is go see if I can find some of the mighty mites. They're not really that mighty, but I'm going to call them mighty mites. Let's go over here to this area. Head out into the dry grass area. And there should be some out there. We should have some room, too. We do have plenty of room. Let's go get out our trusty axe and get another one of you for sure. Okay, good. We have two meat that we need to cook up, so i got to remember to do that once we get back. And if we go out this way, we should pretty soon. Is that box over there, that juice box, run into some mites. Hopefully just... I hear him. Hey, buddy. Good. I'm glad you came by. We needed you. Let's go ahead and get this. I mean, this is probably what bottled water is. Hey, look at that. Stink bug. I don't want a stink bug. Let's go and get these guys. Okay, got both of them. We're going to have to have quite a few mite fuzzes if we're going to make enough arrows. And we also need one more thing. And I do know they're over here in this area. It's getting one that's going to be the problem. Okay, cool. Um, there's also something here, if you know where I am on the map, right here, it looks like that little inlet right thing right there. If you come down here, I will show you what is, ooh, hey. What are you guys doing? Are you guys being, being morons? Okay, where's the aphid? There he is. Oh, okay, this place. Yes, we do got to do this, don't we? One clover leaf, a plant fiber. How much room do we have? We have two spots. If we can do this, then we can also get this, and we need to do that soon anyway. So let's go and do this. We need a clover. Let's go find a clover. I think we also need a sprig. I think we need two sprigs. We'll add this to that. This is that area that we gotta go get this filled out anyway. 
So let's go and do that. Okay, now we need two plant fibers and a clover. We almost have this done. I totally forgot about that. There's a area behind those acorns and there's the thing we can get rid of and there's a door back there i haven't been in there so i have really have no idea what's in there but i do know there is a door or a wall we can bust down getting there is going to be the fun part okay we'll grab a couple of those we're going to make sure they grab a few of those now we got to go get un l clover so let's go see about that. That's going to be right up over here, close by. Clover! Okay. That was all I got to do is go find my way back. So we got to go down over here this way. It's right past over here. And it should be right down beneath this leaf. And there's what we need to do is bombardier. Sweet. We just got a hundred Ross eye ants. We just got a hundred Ross eye ants. Okay. One more thing that you probably saw just a glimpse of is a bombardier. There he is. Let's go see about him. I got it. Ouch. Oh, duh, I got it. Now we gotta come back and get our stuff and fight him again. Bombardier's kind of guarding our little bag here. Our backpack. This may not be as easy as we hope it is. Let's get up out of his way so he can't see us. Okay. Rabbit's foot. Morton wore lipstick. Fake hall pass. Whew. So Looks you can like imagine how good. long it's going to take the spider if it's going to take this guy this long. Good. This will work right here, too. We can do this. Let's X. Taking a look around. There's a new one found. Good. Got him. I remembered. I remembered. Doesn't happen very often, but once in a while. <laughs> He's almost done. One more shot. Yay! He's done, and he's done, and we got a bombardier. ear. Awesome. We did it, we did it, and it wasn't that hard, besides the first time that we died, you know, but... That was that part. Okay, let's go ahead and eat some of this. Good so that way I'm we hungry. can get the rest of our arrows because that's important. We have some slime stocks that didn't get put away and different stuff. Okay. Um, let me go in and get out my torch. Where's my torch? What do we have lurking around out here? Okay, looks like there's still a few more arrows up here that I did not see. Alright, I think we have our arrows. Um, four. Okay, we have 71. We lost some arrows somewhere, but I think they're going to be... Possibly down here somewhere. Does look like it. Nice, we can use that. At Thank least you. it's clean. Ish. Okay, and I do believe there's gonna be, yep, 
couple more over here. Sometimes they just don't show up for whatever reason. Larva down there. I really don't want to fight another Bombardier right now. Okay. We will come back. We will get that place, place busted open where that leaf is. At least we know where it is. So that's not going to be that big of a deal. And let's get back home. That's where we really need to be right now. Okay. I don't know exactly where we are. We're not going to go that way. We want to go... Apparently this way. Ouch! Um... Okay, we should be close by our home now. Good. That was close. Now we just gotta watch out for our um, friendly little friends, if you know what I mean. Our eight-legged friend, since it is night time now. Let's go ahead and make sure that we eat something. We don't have any cooked food right now, but we can always eat that. That'll help. Okay. Let's get back home and let's go ahead and evaluate and maybe even just see about... Upgrading the bow some more because I think we're just gonna have to if we're gonna take on the spider and actually be successful Let's go down. Let's scan the things that we got because we have a Bombardier part and we also have a boiling gland and then we're gonna use some of this stuff to Upgrade our weapons and our armor in a little bit and hopefully we'll be able to Do pretty good. That would really really be nice. That was something that I am looking forward to how much room do we have? We have quite a bit of room. Let's go and take some extra food. You never know. We may be getting hungry or something. And once we get a few more bombardiers, then we'll be able to make the insect axe. And that is going to be awesome. So far, the wall seems to be working. It's not broken down. That's good. Hey, Bergalanimus. We're coming down to talk to you, man. Well, not talk to you, but use your equipment. Gonna be really close to getting the next brain power, so that's gonna be awesome. Right, stuffed bombardier, jerky rack, sweet, getting close. And the boiling land. That is gonna help. Bombardier head mount, to it really close. Only have 25 points to go. Okay. Probably here very very soon. What we're gonna do is we're gonna come down here We're gonna come through here and we're gonna go down to that water down there and Get the area where we have to go through that long tunnel and come out in the pond. We're gonna get that done soon, but we gotta Get some other things done first because I want to have like the bone dagger and different things like that So that's gonna help us out the most no friends over there. That's good. I still like to be cautious, though. You never know. Things do happen. Sometimes they just decide not to, you know, cooperate, not listen. So there is that. All right. Let's go ahead and get our stuff upgraded one more time, at least for the bow, and possibly get our armor done. At least a little bit. That would help. All right, here we go. Let's do the bow one more time. Select. It's going to take six to do 15% more damage, and let's just go and upgrade that. All right, that's enough. I'm not going to get too worried about doing it a lot. Let's go back and let's go see about upgrading this stuff some. 5% more defense. We're going to do a few. We'll, let's do 
two on each. I don't see what that's going to hurt. And this is really good armor, so we're going to do that. Cool. Then we'll do this too. All right, we have six of the armor plating left. There is still quite a few pieces in here. I have those pieces there, nine and 12. So we do have quite a bit. Let me just go ahead and find some room to put this stuff so we have it. Okay. I have a fiber bandage that I probably don't need to be carrying around. An extra one. I don't know where it got made at, but it did. Good. So now we have bombardier stuff. We need to go out and get way more if we're going to be successful here. But for right now, I think we did pretty good. We got some better armor. We have our Koi scale armor, which is very good armor. And it's even better than the normal armor. So that's good. Maybe it will help keep us a little bit protected. And I'm thinking what we can do is maybe take on some of the other orb, orb weavers and stuff also in the process and see about getting some other, uh, mm -hmm. like the Mithraticism or whatever that word is, spider stuff. That would be good. That would help us out quite a lot. And that's going to be awesome. Let me gather a leaf or two, a rose petal. Okay, apparently we didn't get one of those yet. Okay, what well we do now. I mean, this is probably what bottled water is. Thought I heard it. I did hear a, a, a knitter spitter. Well, we gotta put that on number four again. Okay, that is all right. I don't really want to take them on right now anyway. But we do have some good rose petals that we can use to work with also. That's awesome. This is Grounded. Thank you for joining me here. If you enjoyed the episode, drop a like on the video. If you'd like to support the channel more, just consider subscribing. It doesn't cost you anything. It's quick, easy, and free. We have some good weapons, we have some good armor, and now we can continue going down over there and seeing about getting the spider get up on that leaf or perhaps have him come to us. <coughs> Excuse me, if we can just draw him out. That would be awesome if we could. We're going to work on that next time, and I hope you had fun. I had a blast. This was a lot of fun. I got some more koi stuff down there, the scales and off camera between times so that's how i was able to build the armor and that's always down there you just gotta use your slime lantern and your shovel and of course your good bubble helmet and all that to go get that stuff and the bones thank you for joining me here you have a great day and we will talk to you next time bye bye